G'day guys, uh, Tom Stewart here. Welcome to the fifth installment of my uh, weekly check-in. This week we are joined by two-time Kaji Greaves medalist and all-around superstar Mark Blitzarts. How are you, brother? Stu, great mate. Thanks. <laughs> What's the news in the in the Blitzarts household, I suppose? Um, <clears throat> keeping relatively busy, Stu. Uh, I'm trying to do some sort of physical activity daily. Um, one to get me out of the house, and two, obviously, to keep fit. I'm not sure when footy's going back yet, so I want to be prepared for that. So I've been putting the lycra on and going for a few bike rides uh, too. Uh, at home, a little bit of cooking. Um, I'm doing oh a little my, bit. George has, been, George has been cooking the whole time. <laughs> I know exactly what's going on there. I didn't say my cooking was good. <laughs> uh, a little bit of a study on an app that Sam Menegola got me on to called Udemy. It's like a cat. Oh, yes. Yeah. I've, I've had a look through that. It's pretty good. Yeah. What are you doing for it? I've been trying to learn guitar. Right. So they've got okay. they've got full guitar like from beginner to advanced on there. So I've been trying to tick through that. I need to get back on it though. I've been quite lax um, the last few weeks. Um, I just get very frustrated because I'm not very good. Yeah. Have you got a guitar there? I've got two guitars there, but I'm not going to play anything. Yeah. Come on. Not a not a hope in hell. Uh, so anything? <laughs> any any updates? Uh, moving on. Any updates on the house renos in Torquay? How's it all looking? Yeah, been going so down there and checking up on the lawn. Yeah, I've been, I have been. I have been. The house is a bit of a bomb site, but the backyard grass is looking schmick. So, I will do a little little question at each at the end of each check in. Um, I think these. I think you'll enjoy these ones. Um, so, first one. What's your? We know you're a jet setter. You love to get overseas and travel and see the world. What's your favourite holiday that you've been on so far? I've had a few different ones. I've been lucky enough to um, tour through Morocco, which you did last year. I did. Did for my honeymoon. Yep, great place. I love that. Um, that was awesome. And we finished that off with Barcelona as well, which is a amazing place. So I'm going to say Barcelona is probably one of my favorite holiday destinations. Funny story with that. I, um, as a thank you to George's family for taking me to Morocco and Spain, I bought the whole family's really good seats uh, to go see Barcelona play. It cost me 2000 euro maybe. And I was so pumped walking through the streets Saturday, getting ready for the Sunday game, and there's all these people wearing Barcelona kits. And I'm like, oh, that's strange. Like, maybe they're keen for tomorrow's game. I got the dates wrong, and 24 hours before the game happened, and I missed it, so I was shattered. Oh, that's an all-time story. That is an all-time story. <laughs> Favourite all-time basketball player? And you can't say yourself. I really wish I was into it when Derek Rose was flying. I've seen highlights and... He's amazing. So I really like him best, as a player. Best dunk package, I reckon, for a bloke his size, you'll see. Best dunk package. Yeah, unbelievable. But probably early days when I first found out about the NBA was 06, 07, when the Pistons were up and going, and Chauncey Billups, Tayshawn Prince, Ben and Rashid Wallace, it was just a good team. So I'm a Pistons yeah, fan, dad. and any any players from those that team, a uh, big fan of. One close to your heart, what's your favourite bottle of red? Oh... I want to go get it. Two secs. Yep, I do. <laughs> I'm from Sunbury, which is the Masson Rangers area, and there's one in Mount Masson area, Windy Winery, and that's a little Dixon Pinot Noir. Fantastic. Shout out to Sunbury as well. Yes. That's place the ashes. Funny uh... you <laughs> <laughs> um, Right. Favourite footy memory? Uh, my first game was pretty special. It was uh, against Hawthorne Easter Monday, which I was, I was um, back early, or it was 2013, the first round one was Easter Monday. So um, that was amazing to be a part of. Um, I remember getting sledged at halftime by Jordan Lewis and he pretty much said, blah, 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 what are you doing out here? And at halftime, I just agreed with him. I was like, I have no idea what I'm doing out here. But we were down by five goals then and we ended up coming back and winning the game. So. Um, that my first game is a pretty special memory. Three dinner guests, alive or dead, who are you having at your dinner table? Oh, who would yours be? Give me an idea. Um, I I have two that I'm quite heavily sold on. So Michael Jordan, um, and even more so now watching the last, last Dance Doc, I'm just intrigued by him as a person and the way he went about things um, in an era that was just so different to what we're used to in sports. And then um, Nelson Mandela as well was the other one that I'm quite heavily interested in and just the way he lived his life and all that sort of stuff. So they're my two. But yeah, you, know, you can give me two if you want. 
Yeah, that's good. That's good. Um, go sport. Roger Federer is my favourite athlete of all time, so I'd love to just meet him. Um, and yep. then I'm also into the uh, UFC, so uh, one of Conor McGregor or George St. Pierre. Again, just an athlete, like to pick their brains and yep. um, Conor, Conor might be fun to have a beer or two with. And by beer, I mean something. That's all I've got for you, mate. Oh. That was, um, sorry. No, no guitar, no guitar, no guitar. No, there isn't. That's, a, that's not yep. a guitar. No, uh, moving on. Uh, sorry, that's that's been one of my favourite chats so far, mate. Um, it's good to, see you. good to see your face. And hopefully we're not too far away from being back training and, and getting into some footy. So thank you for making the time. And um, I'll see you soon, bro. Mate, can't wait. Can't wait to be out there um, playing some games and, and just back training with everyone. I miss everyone. So can't wait. Absolutely. Absolutely great. Enjoy, mate. Enjoy the rest of your day. See you, dog. See you soon. Shout out to Ford for this. Um, it's a great sponsorship to have for this period. And very, very fun to chat to my teammates and have a bit of fun with them. And I think this is one of the better ones we've had so far. So thank you to Ford for, for all your help.